What is going on YouTube? This is Nick from Hilltop TCG. I'm just throwing together a quick YouTube video to review um, a couple of new tins, the Tyranitar and Empoleon tins. So there's been a little bit of reservation from people against these because of the pack selection. Um, I'm going to dive into these to get my own opinion on it. Um, right now they're on HilltopTCG.com for $40 for both of them. So that's a pretty significant savings. I think it's $25 retail per 10. So go take advantage of that on Hilltop TCG. There is a limited stock, but I'm gonna review these today just to get my own opinion. Don't forget to like this video, um, subscribe to Hilltop TCG on YouTube, and also check us out on Instagram at Hilltop TCG. So let's, let's just dive right into it. Let's get away from my face. Um, so yeah, we have the Empoleon tin and the Tyranitar tin. So both of these obviously have the two um, ultra rare cards. And then we also have five packs in these tins. I think they're starting to stray away from um, the four pack tins and starting to go with this new version of the tin setup, which I like. So from the reviews that I've seen from people, let me get rid of this this plastic wrap here. Let's just start diving into this. Um, from what I understand, oh, these are terribly loud. I'm gonna just take it over here so you guys don't hear it from the mic. Um, my goodness. Um, so there should be two battle styles and then um, two battle styles, uh, Guardians Rising, Sun and Moon, and Darkness Ablaze. So let's take a look. Let's see if we have the same pack selection. We'll take a look at the promo real fast, but this is what I'm mostly concerned about. So we got two battle styles, Darkness Ablaze, Sword and, Sword and Shield, Base, and then Guardian Rising. All right, so we got the same selection as everybody else. All right, let's get both tins open real quick. Let's get our promo out. We can take a look at that in a moment after we get Tyranitar open. Get this off screen. So there are little pulley tabs, okay. I'm used to these whole things just being um, fully encased in plastic wrap. I guess that does make it quite a bit easier when you hit it on the little perforated thing. All right. Let's get this Tyranitar tin open. I'm assuming we'll have the same pack selection. We'll get the Tyranitar promo out. Looks like, yeah, it's a promo. Okay, get that put away. All right. So we got two battle styles, Darkness Ablaze, Sword and Shield, and Guardians Rising again. So let's take a look at what kind of hits we can get out of 10 packs out of the new Tyranitar and Empoleon tin. So again, these are on Hilltop TCG right now for $40 for two tins. I'm trying to discount these. Um, Obviously, packs are still hard to come by, and I mean, isn't the most amazing pack selection. I think if they threw in a good old Vivid Voltage, people would be eager to get these a lot more than than uh, probably the Guardians Rising. But you know what? I'll take what we can get here. I'm going to try to keep the code cards um, hidden from you guys, so I can be just as surprised as you are. All right, we got a Metal Energy, Firo, Carvana, Scape Rope, Pondage, um, Gligar, Electrobuzz, Bellsprout, Bronzong, our reverse is a Cher Cher Cherub Cheruby, and Electrovire, regular rare. All right, I think that's the only one I'm probably going to slow roll here. Um, we'll put, let's just put our bulk to the side. Nothing special there. Um, I'm probably going to change around the order here because I probably want to open up Guardians Rising first just to get a good idea um, or I guess get the least desirable card out of the way. Hey, there we go. Tyranitar V in the Battle Styles set format. So let's take a look at the difference. So there is Tyranitar over here from the actual set, and then our promo to the to the right. So not bad. 
All right. Well, we got a hit. I'm going to switch this around real fast. I think let's go Charizard hunting first or last. We'll keep it on that order on the next box. So this is out of the Empoleon tin. All right, baby. Okay. Um, try to keep these code cards concealed so I can be just as surprised. All right, Guardian Drizing. Hey, we got a hollow. Galissapod hollow. All right. Not bad. So we've seen, I guess, a, a decent ratio so far. Okay. Sword and Shield base code card. Come on, baby. Um, nothing. Chinchino, regular rare. Okay, can we be that lucky and get a Charizard out of one pack? Well, it's a white code card. It's flipped the opposite way. I don't know if you guys are too familiar with Darkness Ablaze, but white code card doesn't always mean a hit. And Toxtricity Hollow. I've opened up a fair share of Darkness Ablaze um, booster boxes and one of the many set, or one of the few sets, I guess, that you can get a green code card with your hit and a white code card with a dud. All right, Guardians Rising. This is our second tin. All right, how are we going to fare on this? We got one ultra rare and two hollows in the last box. I mean, hollows aren't anything to go right home to mom about, but not too bad. I mean, out of five packs, you want to get one hit. Um, you're definitely not guaranteed a hit out of five packs. So you can't be too picky. Hopefully you guys are enjoying those code cards. Um, let me know what you think about these tins in the comments. Obviously, hey, we're getting just hollow after hollow. Meow stick hollow. We've gotten three hollows out of these tins. Um, yeah, let me know in the comments what you guys think about this product. Obviously, it's not incredibly exciting um couple couple cool promos um but it's it's packs open and it's still not the easiest in the world to get packs i would love to see uh chilling rain in these tins but obviously they were probably printed a long time ago oh there we go we got a full art karina's focus out of battle styles Rapid Strike, Karina's Focus. I have not pulled this card yet. Check that out. All right, I'll take it. Okay, a full art out of five packs. Um, yeah, I mean, you, you seriously cannot ask for more than that. All right. Hopefully you guys like this new setup. Um, trying to be adventurous, trying to provide you guys with new, new better quality videos. Um, so instead of using the streaming software, I'm just, just recording. Hopefully it's much better quality. Um, I'm hoping it is instead of streaming over the internet and Wi-Fi. Cloyster, from what I can see, it's pretty fantastic so far. All right, last pack. Can we get lucky and see a Charizard? How would that be? Ooh, we got a green code card. Bummer. Maybe... Maybe, maybe there's that chance of having an oddball pack. Uh, nope. Gramble and a purloin. All right, guys. So, I don't, I don't, I mean, a lot of people have been complaining about these. I, I'm not, I'm not too terribly disappointed. I mean, out of 10 packs, we came out with a full art and a Tyrannus RV. I mean, I, I, I'm not at all disappointed. So, again, um, these tins are on our website for $40 a piece, you guys. 40 bucks. HilltopTCG.com. Um, please, please check it out. Um, and you know what? I think that's, I think it's a good rip. It's a fun rip. Um, and honestly, you won't be disappointed. So, again, yeah, don't forget to uh, like this video. Um, subscribe to HilltopTCG on YouTube and on Instagram, both HilltopTCGs. 
we've seen a lot of love this past um, past month. We just hit a thousand subscribers on Instagram. We're doing a giveaway right now on Instagram throughout the week. We're doing a bunch of Chilling Rain products throughout the week for our giveaway. So yeah, check us out, you guys. Um, hopefully you like this review, and I appreciate the love, everybody. Thanks.